Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another GT Online video. My name is Saints Fan, and today in this episode of Did You Know? Did you know about the newest, rarest item in the game? Yes, that's right. With the new Arena Wars DLC, rocks are added yet another almost impossible thing to acquire. I want to say only 0.000001% of players have this and will ever get it because it's that ridiculous to get. But if you like collecting those things, well, then this is for you. This has to do with aliens, with UFOs, with Kiflam, and drinking until you pass out. So let's hop right in. Now, this all started about a year ago when Rockstar added this alien bunker mission to the game that was super hard to achieve. You guys remember with the gun running update, I believe, Rockstar added this alien mission where an alien spaceship would crash and there would be aliens, the military, and an alien egg. The way you actually did this was by completing 600 resupply missions, which is a lot. And then once you reached that 600 limit, if you started a new resupply run between 2100 and 2300 in GTA Online, this alien resupply mission would spawn. Well, unfortunately for this new rarest item in the game, you need to have that completed, which I'm willing to bet barely anybody does. So if you even want to think about getting this newest item, then you need to have done 600 resupply missions and retrieved that alien egg from that alien resupply mission. Now, the next part actually has to do with the nightclub. With the nightclub DLC, rocks are added the ability to pass out in your nightclub and spawn in various locations. Well, one of the super rare locations was on top of the Kiflam building, and you actually unlocked a Kiflam t-shirt. And up until now, that was probably the rarest item in the game because it took people 100, 200, 300 times of passing out and spawning out different locations to end up at the Kiflam one. I actually still have yet to get that happen to me. And I think I'm on like 250 times passed out. So needless to say, it is a very difficult thing to get because it all comes down to luck. Now this new item, this new rare UFO Kiflam item, you actually get it in a similar way. You have to drink and pass out. But the way it works is you have to, like I said, have done that alien resupply mission. And then you actually have to drink and pass out when the weather in your session is either raining, a thunderstorm, or snowing. And you also have to make sure that weather is happening between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m. in the game. And then on top of all that, it's not a definite chance of you getting this you have to drink and pass out and hope that the game gives it to you. And eventually, if all done correctly and if you get lucky enough, you will spawn on Mount Chiliad. You will see a UFO like here and you will have the tattoo, the Kiflam alien secret tattoo on your back. But like I said, I don't think many people are going to go through this because of the amount of time required. The fact that you have to do 600 resupply missions, the fact that you have to find a session between 1 and 4 a.m. that is either raining, snowing, or thunderstorming, and then the fact that you have to rely on luck to spawn you up in the mountains, it's just, it's a lot. But if you do want the rarest item in the game, and I don't know if anything is going to get any rarer than this, then that's what you got to do. So just to recap, this is exactly the steps if you want to see. This is what Fun said. Complete the alien egg mission. Then make sure the weather in your, raining, uh, in your session is raining. Go between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m. You have to drink in your nightclub until you pass out. And then hope that it spawns you up on Mount Chiliad where you'll see the UFO. And actually, what you'll see once you go back to the tattoo shop is this new tattoo which is just three question marks, which is also a very interesting. And obviously this leads to so much other speculation on the Mount Chiliad mystery. Does it continue? Is this it? What is Rockstar trying to do here in GTA Line? They obviously want people to keep playing their game 
because of this damn mystery. But the bottom description of it does say inspiration from beyond the stars. So who knows where this alien Easter egg is going to go. But Rockstar are definitely doing something and they're taking us in some freaking crazy direction with it. I will leave a link in the description to the GTA forums thread where a ton of people are talking about this and everything. So if you want to know more info, you can go down there. All of these pictures are coming from that thread. And I'll also leave a link to a couple of YouTube videos of people actually seeing the UFO in case you want to see it for yourself. Because if you're like me, you probably ain't going to do this. I, I don't have 600 resupply missions. I don't think I have anywhere near that because I hate that stupid gun running stuff. I'd much rather do import and export or even the nightclub missions. So I doubt I'll be getting this anytime soon. But if you're up there, then you might want to give this a shot. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Hopefully this episode of Did You Know You Did Not Know. Let me know in the comment section what do you think Rockstar is doing with this UFO stuff and the alien stuff and the whole Mount Chilean mystery. I mean, obviously they have something in plan, but what the hell is it? We will never know, probably. Anyway, thank you all. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one.